Congratulations to Charlotte Dibanda. Yes, this time around, she is not only engaged like we did talk about in the previous days. She is now she is now a married woman. Yes, the MMA coach Fernand Lopez has officially married Charlotte Dibanda, and of course. Uh, some pictures which were caught during their traditional wedding in a very discreet and secretive manner just with a few family members and close friends as invitee and this comes after Fernand Lopez proposes to Charlotte Dibanda a few days ago in a plane and it appears that this celebrity couple could not wait for a very long time before walking down the I.O. wants to tie the knot with each other. Join us to congratulate the newly wedded couple and say may love and happiness be their portion. Of course, that is a man from us. So we say congratulations to these two. I will wish them a happy marriage life. Of course, we also talk how several women have uh, taken to the street to cry out for water scarcity. This issue of water scarcity in Cameroon ceased not to stop and this time around, this women took to the streets to cry out that uh, that that was uh, in Limbe southwest region of Cameroon yesterday Wednesday to say that three weeks is enough to go without water note that water is life and they said life has not been life has life has been unbearable sorry without water and how do you expect people to cope without water during this period especially this is the time where they have to cook several meals and do a lot of things that need water the constant water cut has been a big problem in several parts of Limbe uh, where these women took to the street to cry to the, to the authorities to address the issue as soon as possible. Note that Limbe is not the only town in Cameroon that is suffering from this water crisis. We have Boya where we, we, we see several persons get up as early as 3 a.m. Some get up as early as 1 a.m. just to go fetch water and to ensure that they be the first to be at the top to fetch water. This has been a big problem and we pray that the authorities that be should look into this issue and solve it as soon as possible. Why not now that uh, the population needs water so badly in order to celebrate this festive period joyously with their entire family. So we pray that these women should open the eyes of the authorities that be to see into it that they should solve this problem as quick as possible so that we can all celebrate together. We can all be happy together. Not it's just a few days to the D day that's a Christmas day. So we pray that they should solve this as soon as possible. We take you out of Cameroon. Let's go what is breaking news in the entire Africa.